Again, this is Priscilla Batzell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expression of Start Studio Gallery in the backyard with uh, the paint that I dumped off the other canvas to see if I can actually do something with this. And I don't know that I can, but I'm willing to try. And I have my Anita's White Metallic and some Color Shift Turquoise. What else? I've got some of this beautiful blue, which is not exactly what I want. I wanted a whole bunch of this gold. We'll see what happens in a moment. And I think I'm going to give myself a present of some of my favorite, my new favorite, because my old favorite was the folk art color shifting neon purple. Excuse me, it was just neon, it wasn't color shifting. Um, I'm a little stressed out. I like this um, Prussian blue. I've never done anything quite like this right now. And, um, and, um, and, um, let's see what happens when I tip this sucker and if there's anything else I want to do. I think I'm going to use, I wanted some black in there and I'm just going to go for it. I was, for whatever reason, afraid to, to do that. Whatever happens is what happens, and I will deal with it when I see what I get. What I get. Do I want some orange in there? I really, really do. But it doesn't want to be cooperative with me. Yeah. Let's just look and see where there are some little spaces and not. All right, there's a lot of paint on there, but at least now I've used up my paint, and uh, we'll see what happens when I try and tip it. It's been sitting a little while. I'm going to pull all that paint right onto the canvas. I'm going to let it run down to the other end and try not to let it run off. I could just throw it back on the other way, and that would be kind of... Oh, no. No, no, no. Go back. just going to use that puddle of paint. I've never done that before either. I'm going to rock that edge catcher. Slide it up. I'm going to throw a little more white paint on there. Or black. I really like the black. Yes, I am. I've got an edge catcher resting on one hand. I thought I meant to turn the corner, but I didn't do it. Did I? Oh, no. Okay, well, I'm going to use that down here. And I'm going to remove that thing that does not belong right now. And then I'm going to take my very interesting edge catcher and look for an OXO omelet turning spatula available on my Amazon link. And I'm going to take every bit of paint that I can see on that edge catcher and use it. Because not only do I not like wasting paint, I'm pretty good at salvaging it. I see a lump in there, the by lump. So that will fall right over the edge and I will be not unhappy with that at all. And I've got more and I'm going to use it all up. And I could put my edge catcher down I think I'm tempted to, um, what have I got left to paint? Not much. Whatever I've got left will cover a few things. Whoops. <laughs> and fix a few things. I can't remember slipping before. I'm in a little bit of a hurry. It's, uh, our stove went out like day before yesterday it, because of the rain or because the tank ran out or some variation on that theme. And uh, for whatever reason, we have no no gas. <laughs> and so we're going to have to go see our friends at the Rising Sun Bistro tonight, which is cool. We love seeing them. Their food is great. And uh, they're in Brooksville, by the way. Should you be in the area, I recommend you stop in. They're not open every day. I'm not even sure when they're open. So I've got some great areas where if I want, and I do, to, um, to add some spirals or 
manipulate some paint across. Maybe I want to take the chain to that. Maybe I just want to take whatever I take and see what happens with whatever's on my skewer. Let it fill in. I got some neat stuff happening. And I could just drop some more colors that I like, i.e. into the spots that are naked and be pretty happy about that. I think I want a clean skewer, honestly. So, I'm going to have to call this something from nothing because there was a whole lot of nothing there. Well, there was a whole lot of something there. <laughs> let's, not, let's not go there. <laughs> All right, yeah, you're right, I just went there. So I like the white, and I want some more. I need some more, and I'm a waggler. And if you waggle, you'll probably pop some cells. Do I want some more black? Or gold? Mostly, maybe. Some Prussian blue will do. Because it likes to sell, and I like it when it sells. I see that naked spot over there. And that pink, and that my paint is kind of thick, and I can cover whatever I want. I really want some, uh, some lighter orange. I'm hoping I won't be sorry about that. Can I have some lighter orange? That's a question I cannot answer without a skewer in my hand. All right, well, it's not gonna give me much. It's not gonna give me any. <laughs> Maybe I'm not supposed to use that. There we go, I got it now. A little bit here, a little bit there, a lot up there, just a little through there. Some through there. And I'm going to have to torch in a minute and see if we can release any cells. That last one I put in was not, I wasn't really watching. I'm going to keep cleaning my skewer off. I'm going to dip it in, clean it off. Dip it in and pull it, clean it off. Roll it over, use some of it on the sides. Drag it out. Put a spiral in? No. I think I saw something else in there. I wasn't sure what that was. Anyway, I like making these stripy compositions, obviously, because there's quite a few of them right now. And the only thing lacking for me is the chain that I want to throw in there. <laughs> and I see a little canvas here, so I'm going to go ahead and give myself a little bit more of that blue that I love. And see if I want some more anywhere. Let's just pull that, pull that orange. See if there's anything else I want, and then we're going to call it good. And this is Priscilla Matzel in Spring Hill, Florida, who keeps telling you that twice at the end of every movie lately. Um, if you want to buy artwork, look for the numbers at the end of the video title. And if you're interested in a class in Spring Hill, leave me a message. It's the same way for the artwork. Talk to me through YouTube comments section, and I will give you an email address, and we'll have a chat. Um, I take PayPal, and I make arrangements sometimes if people really want to buy an artwork. Just talk to me, and we'll figure it out as best you can. All right, so I'm happy with that, and I have not torched yet. And I'm just a huge fan of these super abstract compositions. And I'm going to call it a composition, because I think I had something to do with it. But we torch to release the bubbles in the paint. We torch to hopefully enhance the patterns. I see that place right there. And I have to make up my mind what color goes there because it's a naked canvas. 
But all in all, I didn't do a whole lot of tipping. We did get to use that other color. I really want some black in there. Right here. I roll my skewer right up. Pull it sideways. I know, there's a danger every time that I'm going to ruin something. But most of the time I succeed. <laughs> yeah, most of the time. We all have our moments. Anyway, back to the uh, matter at hand, which is making sure I don't find any more spots of canvas, which I have found several. Stick your finger in them. <laughs> they go away really fast. We still got a really pretty pattern and I got five minutes and 54 seconds left and that's cool. If you shot my Teespring, the clothing that I put my artwork on, it's right under the video and you'll help me out. If you want to help me out, there are several ways to do it. The first one is by giving me a thumbs up. It tells the YouTube algorithm to place my video in better locations or more often or whatever it does. I don't know. It's a mystery to me. But um, it does work and you guys have been helping out a lot so I really appreciate that. I appreciate your help. I appreciate all the contributions I've had in the past that have kept me painting. And if you want to make a contribution to ke help keep me painting, it will also get you into a monthly drawing where on the end screens of the last 20 seconds of this video, you should be able to find, usually, as soon as I make one, a video. I haven't done so for this month yet, but um, I will be shortly. Anyway, so on the end screens also, there's my website. There's a playlist with over 650 videos. And if you um, feeling like helping me out, it's a huge help if you watch my videos. But if you watch more of each video longer, it's an even bigger help. Um, so I've just recently decided that uh, not only is PayPal and Patreon a great place for you to contribute to keep the studio rolling, but if you have an interest in being in the contest and you want to just go straight from whatever to a gift card from Michael's, that's available also as an entrance into the um, contest. As soon as I receive one, I'll put you right in and send you a receipt, as long as I have your email address. So make sure to include that, please. I think I like this. Hopefully that wasn't stepping on anybody's toes. I have a little canvas down there that I can see. I'm going to need a clean skewer. It's time to get ready to go, go out. Since there's no stove, it's not much of a choice, i got to say. So, I love you guys. There's over 86,000 of you right now, or very close to that as I speak to you. And um, keep watching. Look for my Pinterest link at the bottom of the uh, the bottom of the description underneath the video, where you'll find my paint pouring recipe, and also my Pinterest. Excuse me, my Instagram. I get that wrong all the time. I'm just uh, sticking a skewer in someplace. If I go much further, I'll probably be unhappy with myself. So I think I'm going to stop myself now. Well, I can. Somewhere around here, there's a crib sheet. I can't remember where I put things <laughs> sometimes, especially when I'm in a hurry and it's hot. All right. I'll talk to you guys soon. Watch some more videos. I love you. And uh, keep an eye out for my book called Because I Can on uh, the Amazon link. It's the first hundred videos from YouTube with the techniques and processes and tools included. So uh, we're working on volume two right now. So hope for that for, uh, for the end of summer. Maybe sooner. But the end of summer sounds good to me right now. All right, you guys. Take care. Priscilla in Spring Hill at Expression Studio Gallery in the backyard, out for now. See you soon.